here we are now going to have equation one and this is equation two the first step is to ensure that the x for equation one and the x for equation two are vertically aligned also ensure that the y at equation one and the y in equation two are also vertically aligned they const the constant on the other side of the equal sign the constant are the numbers without x or y next let's consider the coefficients of x and y now in equation one the coefficient of x is two and the coefficient of y is three for equation two the coefficient of x is two and the coefficient of y here is one whenever is one we don't usually write it the coefficient of x for equation one and the coefficient of x for equation two are the same hence we are going to subtract by elimination 2x minus 2x is zero three minus one will give you plus two three y minus one y is two y and eight minus four is four next we're going to have that two y is now four y is now four divided by two and y is now two you see we have obtained that y is two next we're going to substitute y equal to 2 into equation 1 or 2 here i will substitute into equation 1 equation 1 we have that 2x plus 3y is 8 we have y so this is 2x plus 3 and instead of y here y is 2 and this is 8 next i will have that 2x plus 6 is now 8 so 2x is 8 minus 6 and 2x is now 2 x is 2 divided by 2 and x is 1 you see we have that x is 1 and that y is 2 how do i know if my answers were correct the last step is that you should check and test for accuracy and how are you going to do this let's test for equation one two x plus three y for x we're going to put one then for y we're going to put two this gives us eight next for equation two we have two x plus y is two and for the value of x we have one and this gives us four if this video was helpful please hit the like button subscribe for more videos like this i will see you in the next video lesson